day two of this product test, AmTurf versus GrowTrax. Um, this is now after a night's um, rain pour. One of the biggest noticeable difference so far that I'm seeing, especially after this rain pour, is the visibility of the product, the thickness of the product, products now that a good adequate amount of water has been been on it. So with the grow tracks, as you can see, and also it seems like some animals, I don't know what got on it and ripped up some of the AmTurf um, and a couple parts of the grow tracks. It's not as visible as the grow on the grow tracks though because the difference as I was mentioning, as you can see, the grow tracks is now a bit more embedded into the dirt, into the ground as it's soaked, as it's wet. Whereas the AmTurf is still pretty on top of it, pretty much on top of it, pretty thick. This is a mess. It looks a mess because it's all still wet. But yeah, as you can see, the grow tracks is really in it now. After some good amount of rainwater, M tra M tra uh, turf M turf is still looking like it did yesterday pretty much I will do another review at the end of the week um, hopefully by the end of the week we'll start seeing some sort of grass growth if the animals don't ruin everything by then shoot I wish I knew how to keep them away.